It's a clear, cold December morning in Waynesboro, Virginia. And when the wind gets up too much, they can Line workers for Ellie Myers try their best to block the wind during the morning safety huddle. But for those who signed up to perform the day's most challenging work on Dominion's new Lexington Dooms 500 kV transmission line, there will be no escaping the big chill. It was already a week into December when Dominion requested the company's help to inspect and ensure that all conductor suspension clamp connections were properly tightened prior to energizing the line on December 23rd, leaving just 15 days to mobilize a workforce and safely complete the task. The line was scheduled to be energized on December 23rd. Finding and training a group of line workers willing and able to do this type of aerial work on such short notice, right before the holidays, was a tall order. But Dominion calls and we they say jump and we say how high. Today's gonna be a lot of holes. We have never said no to Dominion on special work that they want us to do and we hope to keep it that way. Flying underneath a helicopter from a long line, which can match and surpass the sensation of a spinning carnival ride, was a new experience for most of them. It's intense. Really windy, but it's a lot of fun. I've got a 22-year career doing it, distribution, transmission, and uh, over the years, it's basically the same routine. But this right here is something I've never done. I'm always looking for a challenge. You like doing this kind of stuff? Oh yeah, I love it. It beats climbing. <laughs> Rather do this all day long than climb. This job is certainly not for tentative types or those who don't like heights. The towers range anywhere between 150 and 170 feet tall. You gotta make sure you have a sure footing and make sure you're good and steady and stable. You know, that wire is really shaky up there, so you just always gotta stay on your toes. Safety was the primary consideration throughout the week-long operation. Each member of the helicopter crew completed a special training course prior to flying, plus a detailed safety plan developed by MYR Group's safety department was put into place. I commend them for the work they've done. They've done an excellent job and they've worked it very safely. Take them at 136, correct? That's correct. Yep. Despite the short notice and cold temps, the L.E. Myers team helped make this line hot just in time for the holidays. Yeah, we're giving Dominion their Christmas present. <laughs> Most definitely.